video. Hope you guys are all doing well. Happy Sunday or whenever I'm gonna post this. I'm gonna post it today, but you know, sometimes we have technical difficulties here on YouTube. So today is a very chill and relaxed day. So I wanted to make sure that I got this video out because I know I've been gone for quite some time. And um, I think I wanna start doing videos on Wednesday, Fridays, and Sundays. Um, leave me a comment down below if you guys would like to see more videos from me, kind of like frequently, back to back. However, if I have the content available, I will put it out there. But I just want to hear you guys thought. Let me know down below. So as you can tell from the title below, this is going to be a decor haul. I don't have a lot of pieces to show you guys, but I do want to show them to you. Um, if you're following me on Instagram, you've probably already seen some of my bigger pieces. If you're not following me, please consider doing so. I would love to have you. It's just like my YouTube handle, at live to shine I will leave it somewhere right here. So yeah, follow me over there. You will see a lot of those pieces that I'm not gonna show today because they're like uh, mirrors that I have in my bedroom, some decor pieces for the guest bathroom. Those pieces are already set up and I kind of didn't want to take them down or whatever. So make sure you follow me over there and you will get a you know, a peep of what I got going on um, other than what I'm about to show you today. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into the video. The first thing I wanna show you is a piece that I got from Amazon. It's just this um, classic Japanese style carafe right here. See the picture right here, right here. And it's typically used for like, you know, water, um, bedside beverage, you know, like, I guess whatever you want to put in or whatever. Typically it's um, water, but um, I've seen people use it for other things like cocktails and such. But um, this is how it came packaged, okay, from Amazon. And I believe this was roughly like 12 bucks. I'm gonna leave everything that's linkable down below. Um, let me get it out. I should have already had it out, but I wanted to see, show you guys how it came packaged. Here's what it looks like. Let me place that right here. Uh oh. So here's what it looks like. Hope you guys can see that. So it's just a little carafe with a little spout and the cup that goes with it. I am going to use this for mouthwash. I thought it was very functional as well as aesthetically pleasing. I wanted just something nice and sleek. I'm a little worried about this being glass because of my husband. You know, sometimes men can be a little clumsy or even myself, we, I have accidents as well. But the uh, the chances are my husband will probably break it before I would. So I'm glad I didn't spend a lot on it because they they can get pricey. So yeah, I thought I could put mouthwash in it. So fill it up with mouthwash, get a little bit out, rinse it out and put it back like that. And it just helps also with the um, storage. It'll be simple. I don't have to keep buying all those reusable um, cuts and such or whatever. So. The next item I wanna show you is just one item. I went thrifting the other day. Didn't really find too much or nothing that I needed or wanted. It was just a bust. But I did stumble across this pedestal bowl that I was absolutely in love with. I've been looking for one from Home Goods for quite some time and I couldn't find one. So I found this beauty. It's in this chocolate brown color or whatever. I'm gonna spray paint it black. But if you can see closely, it has a snake skin or croc skin or whatever skin that is detailing. So I thought that'd be really pretty if I do it in maybe like a matte black and put a clear coat on top of it. Thought that'd be really, really pretty. And it's pretty big. And I paid $8.99 for it. And I did have some Goodwill points. So I think this roughly came around $6 or whatever. So I got that. I'm excited about that. Next, I got a piece from Burlington. This is the infamous little trinket box that everybody has been picking up from Burlington. It's all on Instagram. So they had a color, um, gold, silver, and this color. I got this color, the white with the silver, because I'm going to spray paint it. Um, in between, a pop of color or silver, but I got the white because I knew that would kind of act as a uh, like a primer. So it just has a lid and it's not very deep at all. You know, maybe throw your keys in there, some earrings, some jewelry or whatever. I tend to use it for like my watch when I take my watch off at night. 
made me my rings or what, whatever. And I got this for $16.99. A little pricey than I actually would have thought, but I still think it's a good deal. Next, I went to Ross. I've been going to Ross since a couple of times throughout the week because you know Ross is a hit and miss you know one day you go in there the next week you go in there something completely different so I've been looking for a few things I know I got a lot of things on my wish list I'm looking for but I did want me some a neutral color dish towels so I picked up these dish towels for $5.99 and it's just a simple gray and white stripe and the quality is there that is definitely there so it's just a nice little um, decor piece that will be in my kitchen. I would not be drying my hands off on this. I'm not even gonna let my husband um, use this. Uh, this is by the brand Cornette Home, made in Turkey. So yeah, the quality is definitely there for $5.99. Nothing special about that. Next from Ross, I picked up this little black figurine. I just thought this was so beautiful. Like I am really into body figures. Um, I just think the female body, no matter the shape, size, uh, color, or whatever, I just think the woman's body is absolutely amazing. And if you've been following me on Instagram, you know that I have kind of had this well, woman empowerment bathroom going on in my guest bathroom, you know, with the um, artwork that I posted on my Instagram reel that you guys absolutely love. And that picture came from Ross as well. So, that picture is just everything to me. So I thought this would be aesthetically pleasing to go along with it. So it's just this little figurine. And I found this exact one, but maybe a bigger size at the um, the at-home store for $15 or $18. And I got this one for $8.99. So I was like, I have to get her. She just, she just thick and cute. I mean, I just love it. Next from Ross, I got me a cutting board. And you guys, I have um, been just like obsessed with cutting boards lately. Like, I think I have maybe a total of like six different cutting boards. Some of them just decor pieces. Um, some of them I do use, but more so the decor pieces are leaning against my backsplash to cover up like outlets. Cause outlets are just an eyesore. I cannot stand to look at a doggone outlet in the kitchen. It's functional, but I use cutting boards to cover them up. So I got this cutting board right here in my cabinets. If you watch my, my um, home tour, my empty home tour, um, my cabinets that light oak color. And I do love the warmer tones as well. So I just thought this tiger stripe was very, very neat. And I love the color combination. Um, got it from Ross for $9.99 and I love it. I'm gonna actually use this for cutting my meat. I like the fact I got this little handle situation where you can hold it. So I'm gonna use this for my meats because you know, you're supposed to have different cutting boards for different situations. So I got more, so I have a cutting board for fruits, I have a cutting board for veggies, and I have one for meats, but it's too small. So I got one that was gonna be a little bit bigger. So I got that. You saw somewhere to put this. Next, I got a piece from Home Goods. You guys already know I already have a piece like this. And this is a um, crystal, and I absolutely love it. It's just like my other one that I hauled. Same price, $19.99, because I've seen them, but they wasn't the right size, and they was much higher. Like, it would be half of this, and it'd be like $39.99. I'm like, what the hell? So I kept looking, kept looking, kept looking, kept looking, and I stumbled up on one one day, and I was excited. It's actually, I believe, a little bit bigger. No, it's, it might be the same size as my other one, but I don't wanna pay anything over $20 for these. I just don't. And I'm trying to decide if I wanna collect a few more to kind of fill it that pedestal bowl, but I don't know. So I got this one right here for the living room. My other one that I had in the living room is now in my husband's little man cave situation. So next item I got from Home Goods, I know it's not gonna be able to fit in the frame, but I'm gonna try to, is this two piece painting situation. I, I got it to go in my hallway. I have a long hallway and that back wall is bare. So I got these to go on the back wall and it is two and the frame is kind of silver metallic, but I absolutely love this color combination. These are my tones and it was $49.99. So yeah, I like that piece. 
And last but not least, I guess you can tell, right here we have a new member to the family, the male bus. You guys, I've been looking for this bus for quite some time. I think when I first saw it, I was watching somebody's channel here on YouTube. I'm like, I like that. I didn't never think I was gonna like something like that, but I like it. And I kept missing on the TJ Maxx website and I'm like, gosh, man, I cannot never catch it. So my friend was lucky enough to catch, um, catch it on the shelf and she got it for me. Thank you, friend. So I got that and that one was $49.99, I believe. So yeah, I'm excited about that. And I don't know if I'm gonna leave it right there or whatever, but it does look good right there. But I wanna get lamps for the living room. I haven't found the right lamps just yet. So I might let him sit right there until I find me some lamps that I like. All right, you guys, like I said, it wasn't much, but I wanted to share with you like I always do. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. You will see a couple of new pieces that I've picked up. You know, like I said, the mirrors from um, the at-home store that I have for my bedroom, they was roughly like 80 bucks. They're gold, but I'm gonna paint them. Um, I have some new decor in the guest bathroom that I shared. Um, it's like a black, um, snake skin print texture, oval, little tray. Just go on Instagram, you'll, you'll see everything I got going on or whatever. And pretty soon when I get the house a little bit more, you know, ready, I, I think I'm gonna do a house tour. Leave me a comment down below if you'd like to see a house tour. It's slowly coming together, but it's still not the way I want before I wanna share with you guys. I actually bought a black circle mirror. I hauled it before I moved. I knew I was gonna put it in this home, but you guys, that damn mirror had you, I'm looking at it now. You look bump on the bottom of it like a sticker and it will not come off. It's in, etched in the mirror. And I'm just absolutely furious about that because I'm like, it was not displayed on the box. Threw the box away and it's, I, I'm trying to find another one. It's just been hell trying to find another one. So y'all know I got that. And a couple more knickknacks. I've been buying stuff. I bought new shower curtains. My shower curtains are like 108 inches tall. I've been having to get that from Amazon. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go do a home tour when I get it a little bit more um, together to share with you guys. All right, you guys, I hope you have truly enjoyed this mini haul. I'm gonna catch you on my next one. I think I'm gonna post a next one on Wednesday. So make sure you subscribe if you're not already done so. I would love to have you part of the Sunshine Squad and hit that notification bell and double tap it so you'll get all my notifications for my upcoming videos. All right, you guys. Talk to you later. Bye.